Welcome to Context Electronics. My name is Chris Gamble. Today we're going to be talking about how I create electronics for a living and how you can too. For about 15 years, I've been designing electronics now, and in the past two and a half years, I've been doing electronics design consulting via Analog Life Consulting. And this has been a really rewarding experience. It's, I get to work with small companies and I get to work through prototypes and really taking ideas through up through prototype and early production. And that's a cool place to be because you're, you're, it's a very dynamic area. You get to explore new technologies. And like I said, you get to work directly with small companies. And consulting itself is an interesting area and an interesting application to build out electronics through because you're not working necessarily through a large corporation like I used to. You're now working th uh, you know, for yourself and with other companies on a contract basis. I've always thought that consulting is the logical conclusion for contextual electronics. And that's because a lot of large corporate jobs require a four-year degree. Obviously, contextual electronics is not a four-year degree. We don't offer any kind of ABET accredited, anything like that. What we do offer is a design portfolio that you can show off at jobs, but it's not something that you can go to an HR department and say, hey, I took contextual electronics, you should give me this job. I think that you could still design electronics for a living, though, through technical consulting. And so I think that that is really the, if you start from day one and you have no electronics knowledge, you start taking contextual electronics courses, I think someday you could go and apply that and design electronics for someone else for money. So I've decided to build out a part of the course called Hang Your Technical Shingle, an Introduction to Consulting. And so this is a available course on contextual electronics available to the, the most advanced members. And this is something that's uh, kind of the everything else around consulting. So you've already learned electronics through contextualelectronics.com, and now you want to go and apply this. You want to learn how to build out your business, build out, find your first clients, figure out how to do all the business owner stuff, uh, accounting and marketing and all these other things. And I think that that's the, the last piece of knowledge that you'll need to really go and offer your skills to other people for money. The reason I'm saying technical consulting versus electronics consulting is because I think this is broader than just the electronics space. We'll have a little bit of content around, you know, you know, high-end electronics or taking your prototypes all the way through production. We'll have a little bit of content around that, but this is really that everything else. And you can go and check this out. There's a link down below to the actual course. There's a bunch of publicly available content showing the high-level topics that we're talking about, like I mentioned, marketing and money and legal and all the things that you might need and might, might learn as part of this course. And so you can see all the things we're going to be talking about. So if you are interested in taking your business, whatever that might be, to and becoming a consultant full time, you might be a software engineer, a mechanical engineer, electronics designer, really anything in the technical field. I think it'll be a good fit. I separate it from like marketing consul management consulting because I think that that's kind of a separate thing. Large corporations, things like that, uh, you know, like McKinsey and all of the big four, all those things. But this is technical consulting. So being out on your own as a solo consultant, maybe working with others as subcontractors, things like that. But but really being out on your own and offering your services for hire. So we are going to take beta members for this, just like we did with Contextual Electronics back in 2014. We had a beta group as we were developing the course, as we were building out particular modules. They could give feedback. They could, they could go and uh, ask me for particular videos if something was missing. And we worked together. There was a small group there. We're going to do the same thing here. We're going to have a small group of people that are interested in this who will meet on a regular basis. They'll get feedback on the videos that are there. I will go and make videos for, that are missing for them that they specifically request. But then we'll also work together. So you know, there is a coaching component as part of the, the final course where I'll be working with people directly and you know talking through how to build out their business. In this case, we're going to work with the beta members and we'll all talk as a group. So we'll actually figure out how they can move their businesses forward. Maybe they're in a corporation now, they want to move out on their own. How do they go and do that? How do we take those steps towards building out a business? So if you're interested, go apply below. I will be very upfront about this. It is a paid beta membership, uh, much, much reduced, but it'll be a paid beta membership because uh, like I said, we have the 2014 experience and we had about 50 people sign up and the first day five showed up. And I just want to make sure that people that are interested in this, that are applying, are going to be there on the first day and actually taking part in the beta membership. So if you're interested, please do apply down below. If you want, you can go and check out more about the content that's already up there. If you have any thoughts about it, you can always email us or you can comment down below. That's all for now. Thanks for watching.